Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you a little trick on how to create a rotating news slider on your SharePoint uh, site. Um, what I'm talking about is this. So uh, we have this uh, nice news module. Uh, and uh, this module, of course, allows you to post uh, news and announcements um, on your SharePoint site. And, you know, the way it works, I already have a few pieces of uh, uh, new, you know, a few news posts uh, published, but you know, you just hit add, create a new news post, you know, and publish it. Um, um, you know, create it, publish it, and it will uh, automatically show up uh, on the page. Now, by default, uh, of course, all the news they are shown uh, in the chronological, uh, in the reverse chronological order, so with the latest news on top. And of course, you can reorganize them any way you want, but what if you also want the capability to uh, rotate them automatically? Kind of have this cool slider, um, you know, uh, slider uh, uh, option where the news will rotate uh, every few seconds. So uh, it will automatically kind of be, um, you know, fresh uh, for the user who visits the site. Uh, there is an option for that. Uh, let me demonstrate it to you. So uh, once you, of course, step number one, you just go ahead and uh, publish a few uh, news posts. I have already done that. I have a few uh, in my case uh, shown over here. And then, of course, they are in a particular order uh, already. Uh, but we are going to change that. So uh, then what we need to do is click Edit. We need to edit this web part, a uh, little pencil in the upper left-hand corner. This uh, we're editing, we're um, you know, trying to access additional settings for the news uh, web part. Here we go. And there are all these different layout options, uh, right, that you have. Uh, the one you want for the rotating slider, for the rotating uh, news, is carousel, all right? So, um, you know, these are just different options on how to present all these different news, right? Uh, this is not what we are after. Uh, we are after carousel. So we need to click that. And essentially, uh, it will be kind of a, a rotating slider, uh, just like this. Now, if I'm not mistaken, uh, by default, uh, the slider will be off, all right? But you can toggle the switch. Uh, so uh, this it will pretty much um, automatically cycle through all the news posts that you have. Uh, and you can also specify the number of seconds uh, that will um, that you you want um, uh, between each uh, news article. In my case, let's just leave it at uh, five seconds. So it will be five seconds before it rotates again. And of course, we can hide this widget, uh, this web part, if there are no news to show. But we that's not our problem. We do have our you know few posts already. So I'm going to just hit publish. And let's see what happens. I'm going to reload the page just so that it uh, takes effect. And now you will notice uh, that uh, you know this will be essentially the format, right? And if you notice already, you can still manually cycle through this as well, by the way, by clicking on the arrows. But um, if you are patient enough, uh, it will uh, uh, it will also uh, cycle through the news every five seconds or so. And I believe it doesn't cycle right now because I manually <laughs> uh, started uh, clicking the, on the arrows. So let me uh, refresh again. And at this point, uh, again, it will cycle every uh, five seconds. Here we go. And then, of course, right when you click uh, on a particular uh, news post, right, it will uh, uh, just like before, it will just uh, um, you know op open up that uh, news article for you. All right. Uh, all right. So that's all I really wanted to cover today. Hopefully, um, this is, happens to be uh, one of the most frequently um, asked, uh, you know, features for the landing pages um, for the uh, for the internet. So uh, here it is, and hopefully, you learned something new today. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my YouTube channel as well as my blog, uh, SharePointMaven.com. Thank you very much for your attention today, and have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.